So let's have uh, the solution to problem one. Resolve the 500 newton force into x and y components, x prime and y components, x and y prime components, and x prime and y prime components. Remember the principle is by parallelogram law. So this is the force 500 newton, and these are the inclinations, angles. So the angle that the 500 newton force makes with the y axis is 60 degrees, 90 minus 30. So considering x and y, the parallelogram reduces to a triangle, a rectangle rather. And the technique is from the tip of the force, we draw lines parallel to the x and y axis to form a rectangle. So this is the x component. The angle here is 30 degrees. So obviously the x component is 500 hypotenuse cosine of 30. While Fy is equal to this, equal to that, is 500 sine of 30. So that's 200. 500 sine 30, sine 30 is 1 half. So 500 cosine 30 degrees is Fx, so Fx is 433.0 newtons. By the way, you have to report the final answer to four significant figures. So zero here is significant because the, the value is 400, 4, 3, 3. These are significant figures. Remember that zeros immediately to the right of the significant figures are significant also. So this zero here is significant and there are four significant figures. Fy is 250.0 Newton. So we put 200.0 because like I said we have to report the answers to four significant figures. Next for the Part 2, X and Y prime components. So we consider X and Y prime axis here. So from the tip of the force, we draw lines parallel to the X and the Y prime axis. So that this is FY prime and this is FX. So this angle here is 80 degrees because this is 60 plus 20, so 80 degrees. And because this is a parallelogram, uh, remember this is also 80 degrees, transversal angles are equal. And this is 30 degrees, 30. So in this right tri in this triangle, the sum of the interior angles is 180. This is already 110, so this must be 70 degrees. And this is Fx, that's Fy prime, and we use sine law. Or the law of signs to solve for fx and F, fy prime. So by sine law, fx has to sine opposite angle 80 equals fy as to sine 30 equals 500 as to sine 70. So by sine law, fx as to sine 80 equals fy as to sine 30, fy prime as to sine 30 equals 500 as to sine 70 degrees. So computing Fx, 500 sine 80 divided by sine 70. So Fx is 524.0 Newton. Fy prime, 500 sine 30 over sine 70 degrees. It is equal to 266.0 Newton. Then with respect to X prime and Y axis, so the force, and consider x prime and y axis. Then we draw the parallelogram. Since the angle here is 60, that's also 60. So the triangle form, this is also 60. That's that 60, that's 60. So this is also 60. The triangle form is an equiangular triangle or equilateral triangle. And the property, property of an equilateral triangle is all sides are also equal. So therefore, the one side is 500, the other sides are also 500. So Fx prime is 500, Fy 
is also 500 meters. So fx equals fy equals 500.0 meters. And finally, x prime and y prime components. So we have y prime and x prime components. So parallelogram again. So the measure of this angle is 60. This is 80. So this is also 80 degrees. So that's fx prime. That's fy prime. 60, 80. Then this is also 80 degrees. So 60 plus 80 is 140. So this must be 40 degrees to make it 180 degrees. So by sign law, fx prime as to sine 80 equals fy prime as to sine 60 equals 500 as to sine 40. So fx prime as to sine 80 equals fy prime as to sine 60 equals 500 as to sine 40. So solving for fx prime, fx prime is 766.0 newtons and fy prime is 673.6 newtons. So that's it.